I would like to read to you a definition. A divine influence or action exerted directly on the mind and soul of humankind. Just hearing that, it may not be clear that those words define inspiration. That word represents a force in life so vital, so vibrant, so crucial, it is much like the very inhalation of air into my lungs. Inspiration. A word that defines so much of our lives that it almost transcends definition. Today I will be speaking about a special little inspiration in my life. She is seven, her name is Sadie Grace, and I am lucky enough to be her father. And while this speech is about fatherhood and daughterhood and inspiration, it can't just be all about the good times. Not if it is to be an honest attempt, then it has to include some of the challenges. Dear Sadie, one thing in life that we can never get back once it's gone is our time. You have shown me how precious time truly is. This is why I am honored to be invited to your tea parties, even when it is just you, me, and 14 of your favorite Beanie Babies. This is why I encourage you to make a mess with your paint sets, or I play an endless amount of games with you. Because while you make my time twice as much fun, much more importantly, you make it twice as meaningful. You really are the little thing in life that has turned out to be the greatest thing. This is your once and only childhood, but it's still not all about you or me or your mother or play or making each other smile. Some of it has to be about the world and how you relate to the world and making sure you grow up to be a strong and independent woman a woman capable of making her own dreams come true. This is the part where discipline and respect and not thinking everything in life is supposed to be handed to you. This is where your slow transition from a little girl into a woman begins. It begins now and it began the minute you were born. I've talked to you today about my inspiration, my daughter, I've spoken about some of the times that make me smile, but also some of the times that are a bit more challenging. The times that take putting a bit of work into. Because I feel that these times in some ways are more important than the times we put in our photo albums. The birthdays, the vacations. They are treasured, without question. But the time in between the smiles and the laughter they are important too. Life really is a journey and Sadie, having you in my life makes all of these cliches so true. I do love you more than life itself. I do want a life for you that exceeds the life I have. And I do wish for you to live happily ever after. And I try my very best to treasure each and every minute of time I get to spend with you and you are a divine influence upon my life and if I die tomorrow my epitaph should read the greatest job he ever had was being a dad